Explosions late on Sunday in the eastern Libyan city of Benghazi damaged judicial buildings and injured at least 10 people. The blast came after Libyan authorities said they had recaptured around 100 of the 1,200 inmates who escaped from the city's al Qafia prison on Saturday. The jailbreak came amid turmoil throughout the country, with security officials saying that prisoners exploited unrest in Benghazi to escape. Prominent political activist and critic of the country's Muslim Brotherhood Party was assassinated in the city on Friday, leading demonstrators in the capital Tripoli to storm the Brotherhood's offices a day later, breaking windows and destroying documents. Benghazi has remained one of the most restive parts of Libya following the Arab Spring Revolution, which ousted strongman Muammar Gaddafi in 2011. Police have been involved in attacks and clashes over the last month between protesters and a government-aligned militia that have left 31 people dead in the eastern city. Witnesses at the Benghazi jailbreak said there had been an attack on the facility from the outside as well as a riot inside, with special forces called in but ordered not to shoot at the prisoners. The country's justice minister says Libya will be seeking help from the United Nations or other allies to investigate how the more than 1,000 inmates were able to escape.